Hello folks. Well, as many of you have seen in my past Optera videos, this has been a challenging bird for me. All was well when I first got it, until a gust of wind on one night caught me when I was launching this big foam bird. I almost lost my finger. Well, since then, I've produced several videos on how to launch this thing and launchers I made for the winter and, uh, and also one I tried in the summer. But this bird bugs me so much that I pulled out all the stuff and put two ducted fans on it to see if that would work instead of that prop on the back. I then decided I wasn't going to ever hand launch it again, so I decided to put some retracts on it. I just attached them on the bottom to see if it would work. To run the fans, I'm using one 7000 milliamp 14.4 LiPo. I attach a second connector to run the second motor. And that's how my connections all are. So here we go. Turning all the left is shot. Come on, Dad. Oh. I'm going to drop the gear. Now, gear is down. I've got everything I can do to turn and pull up. Nothing. Okay, we're off. What it is, is you're going to have to stand here, and I'm going to go for a walk. Well, here's the post-mortem. It actually had a little damage, but I had to go back the next day to find the battery. It was about 25 feet to the left and 25 feet to the front of the crash. I couldn't find it the first time. I spent a couple hours out there. So I'm not sure what happened. I rechecked everything and made some slight changes on the angle of the motors and the CG location. I also added a satellite receiver to the orange telemetry receiver just in case something happened there. It flew in at full power, uncontrolled, and that was it. 
So I'm ready to try it again, so please stay tuned to see the next episode of this aircraft that keeps haunting me. <laughs> I'm not going to give up, and uh, you wouldn't expect me to anyway. Thanks for watching.